1963, a routine training flight turned into a life-changing emergency for one young RAF pilot. He had been soaring at 29,000 feet on the last day of his advanced flying training when all of a sudden a warning light told him the plane's only engine was on fire. Trusting the instruments, he shut down the engine and activated the flame retardant, knowing it would make the engine inoperable. After calmly calling out Mayday, he then pointed the nose down and tried to maintain enough speed to keep him from stalling. For five torturous minutes, he descended over North Wales. But at 800 feet, his heart sank when he noticed power lines strung across the runway he was about to use. Rather than eject, he attempted to save the plane, and nearly did until crosswinds pushed him sideways off the runway and into a row of telephone poles. The pilot nearly lost his legs in the crash, but his coolness remained an example to other pilots for years to come. It was only later that he learned the alarm had malfunctioned. There had been no fire after all.